Hi there, Aries. Thank you so much for tuning in. Love and light to you all here. It's your full moon in your very own sign. Oh my goodness. Uh, full moon's already being a point of culmination. Strong energy flow, right? The peak of the moon cycle um, related to... Uh, sort of the, the finality of perhaps what has been a long cycle and chapter. The daughter swords come in right up and out for you, Aries, at the apex of your reading. Um, you may be dealing with an air sign. I'm hearing an earth sign though as well. Someone who's very, I'm hearing shy specifically in how they speak of what they're feeling. I'm getting that right up and out here. Two of cups accompanying this daughter of swords. Um, there may be something though that, that comes uh, to a point of, of culmination. It's like, this is the ticket and I've got to issue it. Okay, sort of feeling be it uh that which let's say this individual may be uh, sort of offering to you as uh the spoken words for that letter whatever that may mean in particular for you it's like i'm gonna actually communicate what it is that i've been sort of pondering on even um and i'm getting that perhaps taking a communicative approach is the focus and is your focus around this time and or that of another individual okay energy is moving through quickly the empress in reverse the eight of swords in reverse the eight of cups in reverse mirroring the empress um this is your very own card in the major arcana aries the empress the ace of cups is mirroring the empress you're confronted with what exactly you want to make of the situation the death card right over the six of wands it has to do with what exactly uh is sort of like opened up and packed up as that official sort of luggage piece uh that we're going to be taking back home with us uh whatever that may mean in particular for you related to the seven of pentacles the nine of wands and i know the energies are moving so quickly aries aries if you would like to watch this in slower motion feel free to click the setting the seed speed setting uh at the base of this uh the reading okay right at where the the dial for the uh sort of scroll scroll bar is okay um and you can kind of change the settings around right aries 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 um falling on my lap is the chariot okay upright <laughs> the mother of wands upright i'm hearing i don't want to go home the eight of pentacles upright the mother of cups in reverse um i'm hearing somebody's commissioning you commissioning you back home whatever that may mean in particular for you somebody wants you to make an appearance i'm hearing a guest appearance on their show i'm hearing as well seven of swords in reverse the ten of wands upright these two fell on my lap right in between my legs okay um there's something that we are closing out the conversation of i'm zooming in here on the high priestess card uh, the card associated with pisces in the major arcana you may be dealing with a pisces or maybe focus on what has felt sort of elusive and it's like i've been having conversations with characters that i don't even know the names of okay and do i want to be entertaining that uh symbology i'm hearing of my work uh whatever that may mean in particular for you um there is a focus i'm getting here for a number of you though on movement and change i'm hearing also abroad there could be a focus on an air sign i'm hearing an earth sign individual the father of pentacles coming through dropping right over the father of swords the sort of feeling i'm getting for you aries is that someone is communicating okay it's like if they were let's say communicating through their actions or let's say through what they were uh, offering uh, physically i'm hearing financially i'm hearing as a sort of form of performance be it in a particular relationship or a, perhaps a working partnership whatever that may mean in particular for you um they're now uh i'm i'm getting it as like uh um accounting themselves holding themselves accountable for their actions with their words uh, and it's like if i was sort of treating you like my bae i'm hearing my honey uh but i wasn't really following up on that uh, in terms of how I was sort of referring to you. Uh, I'm getting it as like exclusively. I am hearing in the contract as well. There could be a focus on legality here. I'm going to now uh, pronounce, uh, I'm hearing our names together as one, whatever that means for you, Aries. The fool is jumping right out. Wants to be involved in the conversation. I'm hearing for a number of you, maybe dealing with an Aquarius. There may be a focus on this archetype in your very own personal chart. This is um, very exciting. I'm hearing very, very exciting. The focus for you is on exactly exactly what turns as a wheel on that grander sort of train of transformation and transformation is the name of this game aries as i'm hearing it pisces as well the death card coming through smacked up in the middle of your spread the four of cups upright the sun of pentacles in reverse somebody is really i'm hearing taking a blow to the ego to communicate what it is that they need to communicate uh to you be it you communicating to another be it another communicating to you i'm seeing it as like if someone was really and especially if like let's say they've got a lot of uh, earth in their chart if they were let's say uh almost like acting in ways that were solitary i'm hearing specifically um acting in ways that were incredibly uh almost like um 
I'm hearing conventional for a number of you, whatever that may mean. I'm hearing conservative also. Um, and it can be related to matters and concepts of love, whatever that sort of resembles for you and right self love and the concept of love being one that is interpreted first on a personal level, how we're upholding that relationship on a personal level being reflected then and how we're engaging in that sort of framework with others energetically uh, and emotionally. Um, and I'm hearing a point of reflection here with the Daughter of Swords and the Son of Pentacles. Um, there may be a focus as well, though, on, let's say, home life. I'm hearing matters of the home, family life, even uh, the way that we're upholding a certain sort of uh, dialogue I'm getting specifically. Um, but there's a tender a tender spot. I'm hearing also a, a soft spot here that is uh, sort of being... Uh, Un undone i'm hearing the the ribbon the ribbon on the box is just sort of being being um uh uh, uh released i'm hearing here specifically um to make room for greater uh, uh light i'm hearing that specifically and i'm getting that it's related to the ace of cups in reverse what feels to be like a brand new beginning it's like yes i'm ready for the tide to come and wash ashore and 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 take us back and then we can you know kind of uh start to actually move in this experience i'm hearing in this union as well well and the sort of feeling is like if there was again i'm hearing tongue tied here with the daughter of swords and the son of pentacles this i'm hearing again reflective it may be the same individual someone who's got a lot of air in their chart a lot of earth in their chart i'll let you take a look at these two cards here um the sort of feeling is that um they want to get out of that uh tongue twister i'm hearing tango of a of a of a type of conversation where it's like i'm not really telling them how i'm feeling okay and again it may be your very own energy aries it may be that of another um the feeling though that i'm getting is that it's it's um it's um becoming more and more of a focus uh to make things very clear and it's like again be it contractual even okay i, I want to write it out okay if i'm going to be speaking on behalf of this party i'm not just going to be representing them physically financially publicly professionally but i want to uh, make a name for it as well what it is that i'm let's say operating in what it is that i am also resembling i'm hearing and and uh, representing by way of the uh aries sorry about that okay um <laughs> A call came through, okay, and an endearing, endearing conversation. Um, very sweet, sweet, heartfelt, heartfelt uh, sort of moment. So whatever that may mean in particular for a number of you, take it as you will. Again, there could be a focus on a on a, um, a Gemini, Aquarius, Libra that really it's like they they wanna they they don't want to just blow you a kiss in the wind. It's like I want to show up at your doorstep and really uh, spell spell the letters out one one by one uh, to to the heartbeat that I uh, am am feeling. I'm hearing palpitating inside of me um the four of cups right over the son of pentacles and the death card again somebody is really changing the way that they are that the way that they're carrying out their um uh emotions uh to you and with you and again aries it could be your very own energy how it is that you are making things also official in terms of what you're recognizing satisfies you and it's like okay well that is definitely the podium that i want to be uh, using i'm hearing choosing to speak from this is definitely the community the group of people that i want to be investing my time and my energy in and this is how i see myself carrying that kind of work out um and it requires of me to in a certain way hold and uphold a certain image that is to be considered public i'm hearing and professional um there's a focus on where you go from here aries and it's so exciting it has to do with perhaps a network for a number of you a large also um uh, scale uh, uh, body of, of work even uh, I'm seeing it as like working with a lot of, of, of big I'm hearing big name I'm hearing big organizations as well that are it's like they're not even we can't even call them organizations it's like this is something that is a complete paradigm shift okay um, I'm seeing it as like a complete transformation of let's say even what your industry is considered as and I'm seeing it as you really setting that stage uh, Aries I'm seeing it as well as being related to a certain individual that may play a, um, uh, I'm hearing compartmentalized role in this process. And again, it may be contractual or legal. And it's like, once we've got, I'm hearing the, the, the name for it. Uh, I'm hearing the, the, the state, I'm hearing registration as well, whatever that may be trigger for you. It's like, we're, uh, we're, I'm hearing on air. <laughs> um, and I'm hearing, we've got the mic in hand with the fool. Now you may be dealing with, 
uh, Virgo, for a number of you, uh, who has their eye on you. I can say it in that way. Okay, it's like they're there. Uh, there's there may be a little bit of stalking. Okay, uh, is the sort of feeling that I'm getting here um, for a number of you, but. Uh, the, for others of you, this is, I'm, as I'm getting it, your own energy, and there's a focus on what you've been really preparing for. It's like, uh -huh, this is not just a nine to five. This is like a, a 25, I'm hearing, hour day, that 25 hour day, that I have uh, been um, not only the, uh, the performer uh, for, I'm hearing, carrying out every single action uh, uh, I'm hearing in the throughout the day, um, but I'm also I'm hearing the accomplice of it. Very interesting, and it's like I am I am the uh, uh, table maker and the table turner, whatever that may mean. In particular for a number of you, it's like the sort of feeling is that there has been a whole lot of uh, uh, I'm hearing um, potential that you feel as well. You've been working with, and you may have been investing a whole lot of your time and your energy and your resources into what feels to be uh, like a brand new uh, chapter that. That um, you're now ready to start reading out loud as I'm getting it okay and um, my legs were just crossed and one of them just sort of slid off the other it's like really hot here so I'm like sweating a little bit my leg just again sort of slid off there and it's very interesting because you've got these two very strong fire cards sandwiching the ten of pentacles uh, the son of wands and the t and, and the uh, I'm hearing ten of cups but the sun upright it's like there's something that we're ready to transmute specifically uh, and it has to do with perhaps matters of translocation change of home change of residence change of also i'm hearing registration 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 here with the hermit um i'm hearing visa here uh perhaps related to the son of pentacles all right uh nonetheless there's been a whole lot of waiting here preparation the feeling is that the time is right now as i'm getting it and you may feel that it's like i just i know it i'm hearing i know when the sun is out i don't need to even open my eyes i just feel it i'm hearing in my bio my bio rhythm uh my body um okay let us get a few more cards out here for you aries um and see how the energies move through thank you all so much for your dear likes your comments your shares your subscriptions i'm so touched by all of you aries thank you for connecting and supporting the channel i appreciate that um so thank you again for connecting aries uh, the Wheel of Fortune upright, coming right up and out with the world. The Six of Swords mirroring the Wheel of Fortune. Okay. Um, how are we making the turns that we realize uh, in a certain way are um, t tempered by our perception entirely? And there's a focus on um and you've got the father of cups who's looking right down at this the, at this sort of interaction with the three uh, cards up top and the four of wands right at the base of uh this fan of two major arcana and the six of swords the father of cups is right over the justice card you may be dealing with a water sign uh pisces i'm hearing specifically and i uh, caught sight of the high priestess um, for a number of you, this may be what feels to be also like a spirit guide. I'm hearing children, ch child. Um, there is perhaps also a Libra involved, or, or this individual may be, um, um, I'm hearing, uh, uh, um, I'm hearing s s uh, star, um, I'm getting it as like they're related to a system. I'm hearing system, system specifically, systemized. Okay, uh, whatever that may mean in particular for you. I'm hearing standardized testing as well with the Father of Cups, the Justice card, and the Three of Swords. Um, nonetheless, though, the sort of feeling that I'm getting for you, Aries, is that again, it's like the world that is that is currently being sort of baked in the oven is really uh being um uh situated uh based on the assets that you are capitalizing on in your mind's eye vision it's like what's the pinterest board of my of my uh third eye <laughs> whatever that mean in particular for you and i'm seeing it as being related to the ten of pentacles it's like i've had this on my wall and i've had that sitting in the corner of my room and i've had this one emblem uh, uh, uh sitting uh, uh this other i'm hearing um altar in in the other uh, atrium in the other hall it's like i've got all of my 
my pieces. I'm hearing my wands, my wigs, whatever that may be particular for you. Um, placed i'm hearing placed and how it is that i am forming a connection with all of them now at a point where it's like what exactly does it all sort of manifest as is the point um that the wheel begins to turn at whatever that may mean particular for you i'm seeing it as being reflective and you've got the moon here in reverse mirroring the father of cups um there's a focus on who is making an appearance, who is uh, opening up. Uh, Sorry again, another phone call came through. Okay, there is a focus here on what is, is it's like, um, okay, <laughs> what is being um, acknowledged? I'm hearing specifically, and it's like if, let's say, somebody or, or there was something that was not touched upon, be it also, again, your own energy, Aries, how it is that you're being um sort of uh, also uh, open to yourself about what you would like to bring into form and manifestation um being a focus here i'm getting that there is clarity okay let us get a few more cards out here as we trail out of this period uh potent 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 energies for you berries here at the full moon and your very own sign and you may be feeling these energies already uh right around the um Oh, right around the, uh, you could be feeling them even a week uh, prior to exactly when the full moon peaks, uh, given that, right, the full moons are potent, and depending on, again, how the energies are moving through in your very personal chart, there could be a focus on uh, the energies as they move through uh, for you in particular. And if you'd like to take a closer look at your very own personal chart, feel free to click the link in the bio description box below, Aries, um, <clears throat> and just input your birth information, and it should calculate for you your placements. Okay. Um, all right. And I'll mention this here. I know some of you have been um, asking if I have personal services, if I do private readings, if I do astrology reports, and I do. Um, I love focusing on astrology reports, given that I feel it just provides such a great basis for assessing how the energies are moving through at any point in time, right? So it's like, well, let's see exactly how your your sort of energetic profile is um, uh, sort of uh, uh, suggested to be... Uh, um, comprised in like an elemental bit way. It's like, well, okay, do I have a lot of Aries in my chart? Do I have a lot of fire in my chart? And how exactly do I want to uh, channel those energies? Okay, so uh, if that's something of interest to you, Aries, I've got a number of services there that speak to that specifically. Taking a look at your birth chart. Let us get these energies through though for you and see what comes through. I'm hearing making room for the baby. I'm hearing assets here. Okay. I'm hearing the greater wave of our performance. I'm hearing shocks, shocks, shock value with a full moon here in Aries. I'm getting it being specifically right around that time. Uh, be it something that you want to present to another, be it something that another wants to present to you, the Sun of Cups in reverse, the Ten of Cups in reverse. Okay, you may be dealing with a water sign here. I'm getting these are past energies. This is like how it is that they were operating in the past. Like they were not, I'm hearing, uh, coming out uh, very clearly with their, with their, words i'm hearing emotions i'm getting as well um but i'm getting that you were really patient with how you dealt with the situation um, i'm getting that you were um really um uh sort of uh could still considering ace of swords coming right through if they weren't communicating they're now communicating aries um it, uh, the feeling i'm getting it again is like you still considered this space to be uh one of of potential the ace of wands coming right up and out the father of swords right up Above the ace of uh, wands um it's like i know that this holds potential it's like don't tell me that this pocket can't be sewn back up uh, together i'm hearing feather by feather the son of cups um okay aries um something really makes you smile I'm hearing it makes you just get out of out of bed i'm hearing the hanged man uh upright the father swords alluding to the hangs man let's get all the cards on see how the energies are moving through okay the mother of swords perpendicular to the father of swords i'm hearing in deep contemplation deep contemplation the mother of swords and the father of uh swords i'm hearing the father of cups though as well again you may be dealing with someone who's had a past a history uh of emotional um okay the four of cups fallen out on top of the son of cups and the ace of swords are now falling on the ground someone is coming out the mother of pentacles upright mirroring the hanged man uh it's like they are they're um 
recognizing what they want to live for. The High Priestess and the Two of Cups. You may be dealing with a Pisces, Aries. Okay, the Daughter of Swords as well coming right up and out again at the apex of your reading. There's so much that 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 is to be said. There's so much as well to be accounted for in a, in a way that is made obvious and official and conclusive. It's like, is this I'm hearing going to be the ring on my finger? Is this the name that I want to have on my? Uh, I'm hearing my my childhood playlist, whatever that may mean for you. Is this the um, the method that I also want to take on in striking up a new chord? I'm hearing in this alliance, whatever that may mean in particular for you related to the Son of Pentacles in reverse. Somebody is making you a proposition. You may be making someone a proposition as well. There's something about a proposal I'm hearing specifically, though, Aries. Um, and I'm hearing the feeling is that the time is now. It's like when, when I feel that the iron is hot, it's like, where's the grill? Okay, I, I want to start um, uh, making, I'm hearing movement and change happen. And wherever there's been a sort of stagnancy, a lull, um, in terms of what has been uh, communicated of on behalf of what has been experienced emotionally, Emotionally, energetically, even spiritually, you are cutting uh, that balloon loose. Okay. Um, now, it's very exciting. I'm getting very, very exciting related to the Father of Swords, the Ace of Wands. Again, you may be dealing with an air sign, Gemini. I'm getting Gemini strongly here, Aquarius as well, strongly. Maybe dealing with Libra as well. Um, but there's um, like somebody, somebody is, is I'm hearing promoting you, whatever that may mean in particular for I'm hearing wish, wish, the big wish, the ace of swords and the hanged man, uh, something that you feel has uh, just, just been needed to need has been needed to be um mentioned i'm hearing in that boardroom whatever that may mean in particular for you and somebody is is taking on a very active role to represent i'm hearing as well to present what they would like to make of the situation i'm hearing again um the mother swords in reverse this may be your very own energy um this uh, aries may also be related to um I'm hearing sandy. I'm hearing sand, sandstone. I'm hearing firestone by Kygo. Uh, da da da, firestone. Uh, related to the mother of swords, uh, whatever that may mean particular for you. I'm hearing sandstorm though here. Awareness here. Uh, <clears throat> storm related to the mother of swords in reverse. There's a focus on what is completely re re reprocessed. It's like if we used to hold our conversations via text or SMS or WhatsApp or whatever. I'm I'm getting may have been the medium of of translation. I'm hearing as well. It's like that's not the way that we're going to be conducting interviews from now on here with the father of swords. Um, <clears throat> the way that things are uh, sort of um, re, uh, re rekindling, I'm hearing as well, themselves, I'm hearing Firestone again here with the Mother Swords in Reverse and the Ace of Wands, um, it, uh, is, is uh, in a certain way making us feel that, that things are actually changing. And it's like, it's not just... Uh, 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 I'm hearing hoping and wishing and dreaming. I'm getting related to the high priestess. It's not just meditating. It's um, it's um, uh, it's mastering. I'm hearing as well how we are perceptively orienting ourselves towards this new beginning. And I'm seeing it yet again. It's like, how do we make it official? How do we make it conclusive? How do we make what we're feeling and what we're seeing perceptively, emotionally, energetically in the imaginative space, um, a space that, that we would like to account for? I'm hearing physically, communicatively, I'm getting specifically as well. And there could be focus on contracts as well that you may be laying out Aries. Love and light to your enjoy this period. Love and light as you move into your very own full moon. It's so very exciting. And um, thank you all so much again for your dear support energetically above all yet again Aries love and light to y'all here um, and I highly recommend to check out your rising ascent or moon sign as you may find there's further insights in there for you and your situation um, nonetheless uh, enjoy this period and I'll see you soon bye Aries